Two, Plats Falco took game one on Yoshi's as well, and I believe Vibration just opted to run it straight back. Pretty cheeky uh, wall jump bear, and he gets killed for it. Oh, good down tilt. Yeah. Uh, it was actually not, in terms of like timing on the dare, that was not perfect because uh, Platt collided with the wall, which means he could have wall teched, which would have saved him. But um, I think if he had done the dare a little bit earlier, it just would have straight up killed with like no chance of a wall tech. Either way, Vibration takes uh, game two. Two. Sorry, what? Oh, flat one, game one. What's that? That wasn't real? Sure. Okay. Okay, so apparently I was misinformed, and what I thought was game one was actually a friendly. So it is 1 0 for Vibration. <coughs> oh, sick. Man, there's just something disgusting about doing as Falco a dare into down tilt. And I'm not 100% sure if it actually confirmed, but like it worked, and that kind of tilts me a little bit. Yeah. Get down tilt. Falco was probably dead anyway. But uh, you never know if you're not looking at the clock. Randall can sometimes pop out and uh, put a wrench in your plans. So I think the down tilt was really good. Yeah, and just like that, uh, vibration. Poised to go up 2-0 if uh, Platt doesn't start playing a little bit more uh, solid. All right, there you go. Now we have an even game. Oh, that probably would have killed if it had connected. Oh, beautiful reverse fair into turnaround grab from Vibration. Good recovery from Platt. That's probably going to be Falco's stock. Oh, God. Damn. I don't know if that was before the lag of the uh, side B ended for Falco, but that was a monster tever. Oh. 
Okay. I, I like I like the idea from vibration, but uh, flat reads the recovery, grabs ledge, ends the stock. Oh. Alright, alright. Good recovery from flat. Oh. This is this is a really scary spot for Falco. No, 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 no. Okay. Vibration. Don't do the one thing that can win Falco this game. Yeah. Okay. So that's going to do it. Vibration goes up 2 0. Platt breathing a little bit heavily. He knows he may have done goofed a little bit. Oh. Man, that must feel good to knock Platt off of the secondaries. I know I wouldn't know anything about that. Uh, interesting. So, let's see. The counter pick was Dreamland from Flat. And then Vibration had to pick Sheik first. I guess Platt just really doesn't want to play uh, Falco against Sheik. I'd much rather play Fox. He was uh, pretending to sandbag, but now that he feels like he might actually lose the set, he decided to try hard. So this is going to be hard for Vibration. Um, this is kind of a like a tough matchup for Sheik. Not not super horrible, but like probably definitely losing. And I know that Platt is also personally like pretty good at this matchup. All right, welcome to the set. We've got Soda hopping on the mic, uh, bring up to speed. Vibration is up 2-0. He won two games on Yoshi's, and then Platt decided to stop sandbagging and go try hard. Okay, so yeah. And then Vibration has a Sheik. I did not know that. He does, yeah. I believe he also has like a Falcon secondary, or maybe like a tertiary. Okay, nice. And so this is pretty much a rinse and repeat edge guard. Yeah, I hate. Oh, oh but he flubs mind. it, gets grabbed for it. I hope he dies. No. That's like I don't know. If you're a fox and you're at that percent and she grabs you, <laughs> you always the IOA, always. Right. Because otherwise she's just gonna down smash you on reaction. Yeah, uh, I feel like down smash or time. It's super reaction. Super really good, yeah. Though. And like what I like to do is if you're playing fox, you di full away, but never tech in place. Because Tekken Place is like the only thing that's really easy to cover. You just cover it with walk forward down smash. Right. So you always DI away and then you tech roll. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense and that kind of seems like the yeah. safest, uh, and safest bet. That kind of turns it into a 50-50 and like that's probably not the best you could do. But like I'll take a 50-50 over just straight up dying on reaction. Yeah. And this should be the stop. Yeah. Yeah. That's going to be it. Cheek gets wave shined mercilessly. And Platt will do it mercilessly. Yeah. Well, we, we saw him flub one earlier. Uh, when realistically, he could have just landed on stage and off smash. Right. Would have, would have closed out the stock. Let's see if he gets the edge guard here. Wow. That was really confident by Platt. Yeah. Another thing is, like, it's it can be really hard to edge guard Fox once he gets to this percent. Yeah. Because, like, he's never going to be low, and you want him to be low in order to edge guard him. Right. Ooh. Nice movement by Platt. That's. Yeah, I, I like the up tilt. That was really good. And then this sets up the rinse and repeat again. Yeah, wave dash, but yeah. Wow. Oh, wow, Fox can just short hop, fast fall <laughs> to ledge. That is ridiculous. Yeah, good. so good stuff to Platt, yeah. uh, stopping sandbag. <laughs> okay, so this, yeah, FD. Yeah, so I w would actually 100% not be surprised if Platt lost this. Right. Like, he okay, he's busted out his main, and like, I think overall, pe most people would just agree that he's like a higher skilled player than Vibration. Right. But like, this matchup can be so bad. Especially if like it's oh, the Mars. Yes. Yeah, like look at that. You're dead. You're dead. Yeah. This that could just happen four times. Oh my gosh. And then Platt comes down on the charge. F smash or up smash, but gets something going. Yeah. Actually, Vibrations has some really good defense. Yeah. It shows a little bit more in his Marth than last game, but throwing out good hitboxes to you right there. Yeah. Stock. Okay, so that that is gonna do it. So Platt pretty much brings it right back. The really hard thing about this is that he sandbagged for two games, which means Vibration gets two chances to make this work. Yeah. And that's just scary as and a like, player. And, like, even if Vibration loses this game, I think he would be mistaken to go anywhere else. Like, this is, if you're going to do it, this is where you're going to do it. Do it here. Speaking of which, Platt is going going off. Takes, no, actually, nice DI, but he's, uh... Yeah, he hasn't taken the stock yet, but, like, that's actually a pretty hard recovery. Yeah. Uh, there's a lot of things that Fox can do to kill you, and, like... The, the only really thing that Marth has when he's recovering is the threat of putting out a move. It's like, okay, Fox, don't try and hit me because if you do, I might, I might hit you back. Like, yeah. Oh wow, that was yeah, that was that was a pretty hard call out. Yeah, chillin' esque. 
Oh, that was a. Yeah, so Platt seems to have found his footing a little bit after that first, like, really nasty combo from Vibration. And Platt uh, knows his percentages as well. He's, he's now he's the one playing really yeah. good defense. Yeah, yeah. Wow, oh, oh. that was great. That was an invincible up air. Nuts. Wow. Doesn't get the kill. It's it's kind of tough. Marth drops low, and you're like, all right, well, what can I do here? Yep. And okay. Really smart to get down, and that was actually just what you were talking about. But yeah. Platt's just keeping this momentum going. Oh, good use of the fair to just like put a little bit of distance on him. He's like, he's on him like white on rice. I love that expression. All right, that's gonna be a kill. He knows it. He jumps towards the blast zone. Yeah, Platt does uh, not look too worried. Good on vibration to SDI out of the uh, the up air. I think that's like so so important in this matchup. It's like yeah, so that's gonna do it. Yeah. <coughs> All right, one more stock in this game four. Vibration taking his time there. I, I do like that idea, especially with all of the momentum Platt has, yeah. and you immediately get this grab. And let's see how much oh, he's practiced. Beautiful, beautiful. Up air, up air. Oh, oh. he should have oh. either done another up, uh, up air or an up tilt. Right. Um, oh my gosh. Just throwing out those moves, just. Yeah, I like the way that a Vibration has changed his playstyle in this last stock. Yeah, be so it. like, look, all he needs is one grab, and he can get an easy like fifty percent. He oh. hasn't, he hasn't really been. Oh, oh my god! Goes for the cheese. Up tilt. No, oh, turn, turn around up tilt. No. Oh no! And I'm pretty sure it's just like at that percentage, just true combos into tipper F smash, and oh, a fox yeah. without a jump doesn't recover from that. No. Oh wow! Really smart yeah. by Platt. Take so, ledge. Yeah. So at the end there, vibration panics. Oh, oh. wow! Let's him back. All right. How does he get back here? Uh, Fox doesn't really want to challenge it. Great SDI. Fox doesn't really want to challenge you there just because if you opt to come up with a Nair, sometimes you get the reverse hitbox and Fox winds up getting edgeguarded. Right. Oh, and yep. we got something started here. That, okay, that was okay. Um, there was no way it was going to kill. He might have been able to do a fair into Tipper, which but would have been better. He's got something going. Oh, air oh, dodge. Yeah, oh. okay. So I think, yeah, he needed that kill. Uh, this is so, yeah. So that is going to do it. That was close. That was really close, and both of them were kind of feeling it. Yeah, and Vibration is laughing. He knows that, like, towards the end there is probably his game to win. Yeah. And uh, let's see if he can do it on the second go-round. Do you want to go play your match? you want to finish commentating? I'll finish this one game. Right. Ain't like we got anywhere to be. Okay, so this is kind of what you're talking about, how he might not go back. I think he definitely should. Okay. Any, if he does anything else but Marth on FD, he's made a mistake. I think you might be right. That, that was working so well. Okay, I am actually going to go play my right, match. So Soda's going to hop off. We're gonna have, we have a replacement right here. We're going to have Legendary Link player hop on in his stead. So they are taking a lot of time to consider this. Don't do it, Vibration. Go FD. All right. Don't I'm do it. Don't only do here it. for one game. Fill me in. Don't. Okay, so if this is game five. Vibration won the first two games because Platt uh, sandbagged. Down. Platt has gone Fox, and Vibration almost won game four oh. on FD, which would have been the set. I know uh, Platt really didn't want to switch off Falco today. He didn't. Vibration forced him to. He really didn't yep. want to play Falco against Sheik. And uh, Vibration showing us that his Martha is like really good on FD. Had some really nasty like zero to deaths or like close to. All right. I'm excited to see it. All right. And Good then, of uh, course, Platt is just, like, overall a very solid player. Yeah, that was a great uh, overshot up smash. Got him, like, when he was trying to dash back. Okay, I don't like the vibration. It's going for, like, down throw cheese. It's like trying to get Platt to, like, miss attack or something. Really? I think you'd love down throw cheese. No, because Martha has up throw cheese, which is better. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, that was perfect. That was good. That's a tough angle. Oh, yeah, that that up smash. What did what did it cover? I, I mean, hope I get to play Dan at some point in this tournament, so that I can punish happening. punish him. For, he, I, it's very possible if he loses the vibration, because um, I want to punish him for all these dumb side beats from the ledge. All right, so this is like this is l That's largely nothing. fine for vibration, but he has to kill Fa Yeah. He has to kill Fox before he puts like too much more percent on him. Because like 120, you're already at the percent where like oh, okay. Nair kind of doesn't connect off the up throw anymore. He can't force it though, he's gotta let it happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But like yeah. as you're trying to let it happen, oh, like this is happening. That's bullshit the Fox can do that. Yeah. Look at how low he went. Yeah. Good pressure from Platt. Uh, he's gonna die for it. But I don't know, he's got a chance. 
Yeah, yeah see? Yeah. Oh yeah. my god. Uh, he he could have uh, he could have uh, just him. rolled yeah. up, I think. He could have rolled up, he could have like jumped up, shined him. Yeah, he yeah. Alright. But yeah, he's got a lead, I yeah, guess. It's a, and it's a pretty decent lead. Oh my god. Oh. That was super good. I didn't know you could like you can true crouch um, fair there and just like shine or like up smash or up smash. Oh fair is not a very strong move with Marth. No. Alright, some multi shining. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's just practicing tech skill. Oh, I, I disagree. Oh, no. I'm oh. so frustrated that works. Like, sometimes it works because, like, you don't catch on before you actually whiff something, but, yeah. like, but vibra he, vibration knew, and he still whiffed the grab. Um, Marth, unfortunately, doesn't have any, like, really long lasting hitboxes. They're all kind of, like, one and done. Uh, wait, wait. Oh, never mind. It seemed like he could have gotten a death combo off of that. But, uh, yeah, let's see what Vibration can do. Oh, it's not looking good for him. <laughs> wow, Platt. That's disrespect. Some people call, like, drop oh, like, down dude, shines. When, when, you, when you have the like the stocks for it, I don't care. If he did it on last stock, then, then I would be upset. Uh. 